Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Kingdom Hearts Final Mix. Uh, we skipped everything up to this point, so now you get to jump right in with Tenille fighting the final round of this. I am Sean, and like I said, this is Tenille, and she's Hi. the one playing. <laughs> Hello! We changed some things before we jumped into this one again. Uh, Don't. Big one is that him? because I actually think it's better to fight him than Yuffie you first. You think so? She can heal him. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. Yeah, so she has a stronger Keyblade, which should hopefully help actually us get through this much better. Um, she also gave items to Donald and Goofy, but I'm assuming they've used them all up because they're both dead. Yeah, it would seem that way. Mm -hmm. uh, he's already in Berserker mode. Yep, sometimes he does it really quickly. Uh, or more, like... It's not necessarily a guaranteed thing at half. Sometimes they do it when they're on their last leg. Sometimes okay. they do it when they're at half. Well, either way, uh, let's see if you can have a better shot at this than I did. Yeah. Hopefully with a different Keyblade, I will. Yep. Oh, <gasps> no. Or not. Or not. You know, maybe we should just wait and hold off on this. Yeah, we might just have to come back to this later. Woof. So, welcome everybody to this episode. Uh, <laughs> we failed. Yep. So, that's okay. Goodbye, we Coliseum. We'll, we'll be back, back later. later. You gave us some experience along the way, so that's fine. Mm-hmm. Oh, and one thing to note is Tenille actually did take some time between this episode and the last, and we, uh, she changed up the gummy ship. Yes, I did. So, we're gonna fly off to the next world. As you can see, it looks very different. It looks ridiculous. Um. And I have no idea how to use this thing. Yep. Oh, looks like we hit him. We uh, hit the whale. Well, I mean, you don't necessarily know if it flies away like that because mm -hmm. they might because the characters might be like oh where's monstro guess he's not here so we'll fly off uh so it always kind of stops you okay. in there well either way now we're here and we have to get to a save point so we can get out <sighs> that's another annoying thing about monstro you can't just walk out his mouth no unfortunately he takes forever to swallow you yep okay here we go. All right, so now we get to fly off in our ship, and we actually have equipped a better engine, more defense, uh, and more guns. multiple kinds of guns, so... Oh, dear. The guns do different things now. I... I don't know how any of this works. We are flying faster. Yeah. Okay. Use the uh, cannon by pressing triangle. I think those are the lasers. They're lasers, whatever. And then your regular gun is still circle. Okay. Wow, we fly a lot faster. Yeah, we're already here. <laughs> Welcome to Under the Sea. <gasps> da, 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 da. Under the Sea. Ba, 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 ba. It's Atlantica. We're going to be have here fun. for a while. Naturally. <laughs> okay, guys, prepare for landing. Land where? In the sea? We'll drown. Drowned? We'll drown. <laughs> Not with my magic, we won't. Just leave it to me. All right. I like how they establish Donald's magic here. Because they never really bring it up as an excuse for other worlds. Yep, it's nope. just this first time. Yep. Look at this. We're different. Yay! Oh, I do love it when we, like, our costumes, quote-unquote, change. Mm-hmm. They're definitely, like, a fan favorite thing of mm -hmm. everyone. Whenever there's a world that changes your costume. Yeah. Even if the world that you go to isn't exactly the best. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> Mm, they do seem a little 
different. Where are you I from? love uh, that the fact kind of away. <laughs> that and in the world that we try our hardest to, to look like everybody else, mm -hmm. they notice that we aren't oh, like everybody else. Yeah. But like Tarzan, so Jane never so questions why there's a walking, talking, three foot tall duck walking around. <laughs> This is true. <laughs> Easy for you to say, okay, it's time oh, to learn how to no. swim properly. You cannot do a Jamaican accent. Well, granted, the guy doing his voice acting can't do a Jamaican accent either. No, so. that's why I'm doing, like, Jamaican light. <laughs> Jamaican light. Uh, in this world, Practice we've got swimming swim. with flounder. Try to hang in. Try to tag him. All right, begin. Yeah, so you actually have to use uh, triangle... And, no, no, square circle, and circle. Circle and square to go up and down. Because they're like, how to do 3D. Well, it's not like we have two sticks or anything. Uh. We can't use both sticks for movement. That would be silly. I mean, in... <sighs> Okay, in the original release of this game, yes, they could have used the second stick and that mm -hmm. would have been better, but thank God they didn't change it for this so that you suddenly lost control of your camera. Oh, yeah, that is true. Because that would be a nightmare. Uh, either way, it only happens this one world. Mm-hmm. Well, kind of. Yeah. Kind of. Maybe not. Never mind. Uh, where'd he go? There he is. Yeah, so this is just a good tutorial to let you figure out how to actually move around in the water. Yeah, and because we have square and circle, obviously any abilities map to those buttons we don't use in this world. So there is no guard, there is no dodge roll, there is no jump. Mm -hmm. Obviously, <laughs> we're in the water. I mean, guard would be nice to have. I wish they gave you some... Way to guard? Yeah. But no, you just gotta tank it. Yep. Uh, which is okay. For the most part, nothing in this world is dangerous enough to just immediately kill you or anything. I kind of wonder if this world would have been better off if they put it earlier on in the game. Not early enough like Alice in Wonderland early, but like Tarzan. So you've had enough time to get used to the normal controls, mm -hmm. but you don't necessarily... You aren't necessarily used to having all your other abilities. Okay. Uh, I think you need to open up that shell. I do. Uh, you know what I mean, though? Yeah, I understand. And look, there's a save point here, so we can immediately leave. <laughs> Sounds like a plan! Nope. Oh. No, we're gonna be here for a while. Okay. Those creatures chased us here. Oh no, those monsters might be headed to the palace, too! We better head back right away. But, but, but what about if we run into more on our way back? I'm sorry, but we need your help. Please come to the palace with us. The trident marker on the walls point the way there. Yet again, another thing I wonder if they playtested this and people got horribly lost. Oh, I am sure. Uh-huh. Because I remember seeing promo videos of this on Disney Channel mm -hmm. where they're in this world and I don't remember seeing those. So I kind of wonder. Yeah, they're very, very useful. It's like, follow the tridents. They will show you the way because this world is another convoluted map world. It's, and it looks very samey. Oh, yeah. We won't get lost as long as we follow them. Okay, let's get going. Now you say that. All right, goodbye, Ariel. We don't need you. <laughs> Except for a bit later, right? E no, no, actually, we don't. Yeah, we don't need her. We yeah. don't need you, Ariel. Pfft. Get out of here. <laughs> All right, welcome to the great wet wonderland of wet. <laughs> wet. Um, yeah, there are definitely chests around here. Thankfully, there are no chests. puppies. Chests. Yeah, as in thankfully, seashell. there are no puppies because they drowned. They would drown. 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 Oh, great. Uh, okay, so this is stop. Uh, stop is the worst. The worst ever. Donald put stop on these guys, so you just build up all the hits, and then they take it all at once. Which you think is nice, but it just wastes your time more often yeah. than not with trying to fight these guys. So it would be better if I Donald wish you never could... used it. Well, and it 
it specifically gets annoying when you are doing like a timed mission or something like that. And Donald's yes. like, there's one enemy on screen that's almost dead. You just need to hit it one more time. And he's like, stop. And you're like, no, Donald, you stop. <laughs> I already, uh, already opened that. that one. I wish they would disappear mm -hmm. after we opened nice. them. Either way, we need to come down this direction. I'm actually not sure we do. I'm just the exploring. The trident said down this way. Did it? Okay. Yes. I'm exploring and trying to get chests, so... That's fair. Uh, this is not a fun world to explore. You know what? Get me out of here. No, it's down. I know it's down, but... Okay, are you just gonna... You already opened that one. You already opened that one. Uh, so I did. Yeah. Um... <laughs> See? Tennille is already lost and we've explored five feet. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, uh, there's a red... Yeah. Red clam. If they are specific colors, that means you need to use magic to open them. Mm-hmm. Stop locking onto that. Lock onto the enemies, please, and thank you. Oh, uh, gravity doesn't pit. work either in this world. I wish you could turn off uh, spells. Specific spells for your teammate. Yeah. Cause... Luckily, that's something they add in Kingdom Hearts 2. Mm -hmm. They set that up much better. And they also only give him less spells. To yeah, he doesn't have all the spells that you can get, which is confusing because he's supposed to be your wizard but he's also supposed to be better yeah but also very very good because yeah donald sucks at knowing when to use magic yep uh this world has a lot of enemies that just kind of wander aimlessly and you have to chase after them to kill them so that you can open your chests there's quite a few big open areas mm -hmm. in this world and endless which is, enemies which is Good, because I think the swim mechanics in small areas are worse. You yes. know what I mean? Uh, so yeah, it's better to have these larger open places, and yet it comes with the negative of the enemies not knowing what to do. Mm -hmm. I would tell you what these, these things' names are, but I do not remember. Awkward... No. Does something? No. I'm say something about float, but that might be completely wrong. I don't remember. I just know that I always have to come back to this world and kill a billion of them because their drop rate is insanely low. For no reason. For no reason, and this is the only world you can fight them in. And you need quite a few of their whatever, whatever drops. Whatever drops are. Yes. I think it's like frost. Frost gems, I'm frost pretty gems? sure. Okay. Easy the frost. Frost yep, gem. Frost gem. There we go. Like we were just talking about. And like they're the only enemy that drops them. Well, and because when you kill them, their stuff kind of drops all over the place. It's very easy to imagine just missing. Yeah. Items that they dropped. Mm-hmm. This is also very true. Okay, mm -hmm. there was one more I thought. Or. There yeah, he there is. Yeah, there he is. Like, again, they just kind of wander around. They're not even very good at fighting you. No. Get out of here. Okay. okay. I think that was everybody in the immediate area. Let's open this with fire. Uh. Let me. <laughs> For a mithril shard. Okay. It's not like we don't have a billion of those. No, but there is no other way to get them other than through chests and that's, other things like that. So that's a good point. picking them all up when you can is definitely the right way to go. Okay, now I want to follow the signs because I think I've got them all here. Yeah, or nearly all. Yeah, enough. Yep. All right, time to the calm depths. And this current obviously is going to try and take you... Uh, All right. way out there. And if it does, you are just going to go right back out to that big area we were just in. So you need to actually curve your way into this room instead. Yeah. And then don't get in that funnel of upwards facing water right there. Yeah, because that that'll also, take, also you take you to the big open room. And it's really frustrating and I don't know why they did this. Just to make the game longer. <laughs> yup. Why is this here? 
Did that just hurt you? I think so. Huh. I I'm not no exactly idea. sure why that's there. That's interesting. I don't know if I've ever noticed that thing before. I feel like that is an HD remix thing. Maybe. Who knows? Either way, we just need to go around. Maybe gravity? I have no idea what this is. Are you just gonna use all of our magic on it? Yeah. Okay. Oh! Whoa! You just exploded it. Oh! What? Oh, this is a shortcut! What? Oh my gosh, we're back to the save point! Weird! Oh, wow. How have we never learned about this? I don't know. I feel like that is an HD remix thing. With as many hours as I spent on the original game, how could I have never noticed that urchin before? Either way, I'm glad it exists, because it means we can get through the through the area faster now. Yeah. I mean, there's never really any reason to come back to this area specifically, but... Well, actually, this is... Where are we? Wait, are we just in the big room again? Yeah, we're just in the big room again. Oh. Well, sweet. So yeah, we can just shortcut uh, right behind you. Behind you there. Oh. Yeah. Lovely. Wow, that is amazing. I love this. Although that is also now another spot where the enemies could potentially push us out into mm -hmm. another map. So I don't know. It might be... I don't know how to feel about <gasps> Oh, mush underwater. Okay. Stop. Yep. Now, stop is a very interesting one because you just need to use stop on all the mushrooms in the area. So there are are three of them that are all stopped. They're all just gonna poop out a lot of magic. Thank you, and, and now I think... One was there. There we go! Alright. And I think that was it? Or is there another one? Oh, there... Oh, it's oh. this guy! This guy stings. Yeah. You have to be really good at this game to get this. Yeah, you need to get like a billion hits on him. Yeah. For him to give you anything. All right, then never mind. We're just going to move on with our lives. Well, yeah. We might have to come back to him for specific items, maybe? I don't remember if they changed that for the HD remix. Um, well, I mean, he's only in the HD remix. Yeah, I know. That's what I mean. Uh... I don't I think, remember if he's required for the best items. I think last time I played this, I actually was able to figure out how to get him. Mm hmm But I it's like you don't need to remember how exactly I did it. Put arrow on yourself and then stop him and then hit him a bunch with like specific attacks or something. Yeah. It's it's very convoluted and You have to look up a guide to know how to do it. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Alright, but either way, we are now in a new zone, which I know you can be forgiven for not realizing. Because <laughs> it looks the exact same. But this zone is actually very close to the city, which is where we're trying to get to. I feel like if they would have put some, like, coral reeves or something in here, that would have helped... Mm -hmm. make this world look a little different. The problem is is that they decided to make this, to turn this movie all into the underground part. And then yeah. they made it with a lot of maps, and we honestly don't spend the majority of the movie here. Yeah. So there's only a couple of iconic locations, and, and then the, the rest, rest of it is, is nothing. Yeah, the rest of it is oh, just hey, stuff they had to make up. Oh, hey, we just got Treasure Magnet as well. So nice. that means everybody has their Treasure Magnet now. Well, that'll be good for in this area where items go flying everywhere. It's very true. So, good timing, game. No. Stupid search ghosts teleporting. Get back here. Alright, and a random jellyfish. Come get it. There we go. I actually wanted to look up what these guys are called. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, oh yeah! Also, the answer report! Yeah, we got it. Sea Neon. Wow. 
I do not remember that. And yet again, in the original game, they were a teal color as well. Yeah. So everything about this world was just teal. Just blue. Blue, 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 blue. Everything is blue. Let's read that Ansem report that we got two worlds ago. Much of my life has been dedicated to the pursuit of knowledge. That knowledge has guarded this world well. Not a soul doubts that. I am blessed with my people's smiles and respect. But though I am called a sage, there are things I do not understand. I believe darkness sleeps in every heart, no matter how pure. Given the chance, the smallest drop can spread and swallow the heart. I have witnessed it many times. Darkness. Darkness of the heart. How is it born? How does it come to affect us so? As ruler of this world, I must find the answers. I must find them before the world is lost to those taken by the darkness. Ooh. Interesting backstory we're getting. <laughs> All right. Did now I open this? I don't think so. There was enemies around. Okay. All right. I think that's all that we need to do right now. Except for fight more Heartless. So I guess we could always do that too. <sighs> I, I'm just gonna... What, what's over here? Oh, okay. The Undersea Garden. A completely optional area. Yeah. That you actually never need to go into. And I don't know if there's even Heartless in here. I don't think so. But yeah, it's the... Uh... The... Under, under the sea, sea dun, 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 under the sea, darling, it's better down where it's wetter. Take it from me, come on. There we go. Uh, yeah, it's very hard to move in some of these zones. All right, that was it. We got a mega potion. Nothing else will ever happen in that room. <laughs> well, that we need to go in there for. Yeah. Either way, let's go to Triton's palace. All right, and now it's these guys. Uh, these are jet men. <laughs> I don't remember the enemies in this area. We're I think they are called Aqua something. Aqua Jets. Aqua Jet? I think Aqua Jet is their name. Either that or it's a Pokemon move. I, I mean, <laughs> I know it's a Pokemon move, but I feel like it's also the name these guys have. Okay. Also, right. White Trinity, the only Trinity in this world. Yep. Because the other ones, the three can't perform because underwater stuff. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Get uh, these guys out. also drop very, like, very specific items. I think theirs are lightning. Yeah, lightning based. Gems, stones, one or the other. Lightning and the thunder. I don't think stones actually exist in this game. There's only the three levels in this one. It's later games that introduce the four levels. Are you sure? Yeah, so we have shards, gems, and crystals, I believe. Okay. It's, once we get to Kingdom Hearts 2, there's stones, uh, there's shards, stones, gems, crystals. Yeah, I, I know that's true of the original game. I wasn't sure if they added stones in the, the HD remix. I don't think so. Okay. Either way, we're just opening more chests. <laughs> if we can trying to open more chests. <laughs> Cottage. Uh, there was one the other direction. Oh, there's one right there. Elixir. You said there was another one yeah, over here? Yeah, that way. Oh, you're right. Yep, in the corner. You just kind of swam past it, so I wasn't sure why you had done so. I hadn't seen it. All right. I think that's all the items in this area. Yep. Whee. Wee. You're doing good job at the water navigation. Wee. Either way, let's go to that <laughs> painting of a castle in the background. <laughs> that was too close. As long as I have my trident, I will not tolerate those creatures inside this palace. Hello, King Triton. Daddy? Oh, Ariel. When will you listen? It's dangerous out there. Um. <laughs> 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 King Triton! 
Hello. And who are they? I was terrified of King Triton when I was younger. Really? Yeah, he was scary. Scarier than your dad. <laughs> Maybe I related too much. <laughs> he is, he's a very similar figure to your father, I feel. Yeah. He's very intimidating on the outside, but is actually a pretty, pretty, nice, guy. pretty nice guy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I would always hide behind the couch during the, like, opening scene. Wow. Not, not in the part where he destroys her stuff. That was fine. But, but no, scene... when he shows up for the musical. Yeah, when he shows up for the musical and then Ariel's not there and he's like, Ariel. I always hid behind the couch. Wow. <laughs> That's hilarious. I don't get, like, I didn't get scared too often as a kid. So the fact that I specifically remember that, being scared of that is pretty funny. you, Sebastian. Have you anything to report? Just as you suspected, your majesty, they seem to be coming from Ursula's Kurato. I knew it. That sea witch is up to no good again. A sea exile from the palace has taught her nothing. Yes, she poses serious danger. And I told you to keep Ariel away from such danger, did I not? Your majesty, please, I... Sad fish. <laughs> Sad fish? You mean Sad crab? crab? Oh, you should go back to the castle then. Oh yeah, but I don't want to go back to King Tri- I just told you how scary he is. Oh no. Is he looking? He's looking at me. <laughs> uh, <laughs> there's uh, one chest here. And it's not even a chest, it's a save point. But it's just good to open that up. Mm -hmm. So that you can actually just warp here later. Yeah. I'm always sad that they didn't like hide anything. Hide here or nothing. Yeah, no, there's nothing else in this room. Yep. Either okay. way. Get, let's get away from them. Let's put some distance between myself and Triton. <laughs> was, okay. Mm -hmm. Why is Sora not a merman? I don't know. He's Why a shark is he man. a half? Is he a shark or is he a dolphin? Oh, he's a shark. I always thought he was a dolphin. No. Wait. Hmm. Hmm. I always thought he was a shark, but it might be a dolphin. It's like Donald's in a squid because he has six. Well, no, he's supposed to be an octopus. He's just missing two. Um, and of Arsenal course. Ursula is actually the same way. Is she? I think so. Oh, okay. I thought she had all the full eight. Nope. Huh. Come to my grotto. I want to show you something. There it is. See? <gasps> you should ride the dolphin. Uh, I can't. Heartless showed up. <laughs> Somewhere. Uh, that dolphin is actually very important for later. Yep. And yet again, another... No one would ever tell you that. Mm -hmm. You would just have to figure it out. Ah, dolphin, you're in the way. You're doing a good job there. Yeah, I I know, I know. Sora is locking onto the wrong guy. Oh, just think, once we get done with this world, we'll never have to come back here again. You say that, but... Never have to come back here again. <laughs> Except for once, for a single trinity, and to mine gems. Yep. Oh, hey, now we have the big ones. Yes. So, yeah, now we have the large ones that can... I already forgot what they're called. Yep. I <laughs> forgot what the large, the small ones are called, too. That's what I mean. I don't mm. remember what the small ones are called. So these are interesting enemies that, for some reason, sometimes explode into little ones. You have to kill them fast enough. If you can land another hit on them before they explode, they'll die, and you'll get experience points for that. Otherwise, they'll explode into smaller ones, and then you gotta fight the smaller ones, and you don't get experience for the big one. Yep, they're weird and dumb, and I, I don't like them. <laughs> no, because this world does that twice mm -hmm. with an enemy we haven't seen yet. Yep. Uh, these aqua jet guys are sticking to the bottom of something else. Yeah, and then. 
when you beat the one thing, they'll fly off and then you have to fight the aqua jets. Oh yeah, we got treasure magnet. Yes, we should equip that. Yes. Okay, let's We don't see. have the MP or the uh, AP. I think all the abilities we have are actually more important yeah, than treasure magnet. Yeah, so do I. So we'll equip it at some point, just not right now. Either way, let's get into this grotto. Grotto. It's Ariel's Grotto. Does this look like an interactable area? No, but it is. <laughs> Luckily, she does actually point it out, though. Mm hmm. Look at all the wonderful things Flounder and I have collected. I think it's all from the outside world. Someday, I'm going to see what's out there. I want to see other worlds. Does that sound strange? No, not at all. I used to feel the same way. Used to? I mean, I still do. Hey, why don't we try looking for that keyhole you were talking about? But your father said... Oh, he treats me like a little girl. He never wants me to do anything. He just... He just doesn't understand. Well, you know what he doesn't understand? What? Ending late. Oh. So now it's time for us to end this episode. Okay, well, I got a cottage. Woo. Mm. My camera. So uh, next time on Kingdom Hearts Final Mix, I will pick up and uh, collect the other items that are sitting in this room and then continue on our wet... Merry way. <laughs> our wet uh, slog <laughs> is the words I was going to use. Okay. So join us back here next time. See you then.